Hey guys, uh, Jason here from CricketStoreOnline.com and uh, just uh, want to start doing some uh, cool uh, cricket gear bag reviews. Um, I've got this little bag here, this is my personal bag. Uh, one of my favorite bags and that's the reason that I use it. It's very practical, it's the GM Original Limited Edition uh, Alley Wheelie. You can obviously go and look at that video review and see why I like it and why that's my, my game day bag and why I use it. Um, so up against it today is the Top of the line Kookaburra bag, it's the Kookaburra Pro 1000 bag. Um, for all sorts of specs, uh, you can obviously go to kookaburra.biz and you'll be able to see measurements, dimensions, all that sort of thing. Um, so, right off the bat, this is a the most expensive Kookaburra bag. It's a very good bag. Quality wise, you don't really get anything better than it. It is, it is a phenomenal bag. It gets the thumbs up. So, I've got all of my gear that is in this bag. I now have it in this bag, so I'm going to show you what you get. So obviously you get uh, the straps that you would carry it with. You also get, it's a wheelie bag, so you've got two wheels that side, a handle this side which you would pull exactly the same as the GM bag. Um, so let's dig into it here and see what we've got. Right at the top here you've got two compartments that you'd be able to put some whites, uh, maybe some broad floppy hats, stuff like that. One on either side and so that'll give you, um, it's, it's two separate bags, so you can maybe pack your lunch in one side, put your uh, clothing and stuff like that in the other one, socks, whatever the case is. Uh, then getting down to the actual bag, just undo these two clips right over there, and open this top section here, which is going to give you access to the two main compartments. At the top here, you've got a big mesh section, which you can put all sorts of extra little bits and bobs in. You could even put your, your pads in here, um, but I've actually got my pads in the bottom section. So big mess section. I've got my um, thigh pad in here, my arm guard, uh, extra arm guards, a uh, shin guard, a hat, a cone, all that sort of thing. I've got this. It's quite a big section. You can fit quite a lot in there. And then getting into the main section, right, in here, I've got a bag of just extra balls, uh, batting inners, stuff like that. And then I've also got my uh, batting pads going there. Right? Um, so then you might be saying, well, Jason, where's your helmet? Where's your shoes? A uh, pretty cool feature of this bag is down the bottom here, you've actually got a helmet compartment. Uh, it's got a mesh section, so you can put it in there even though it's sweaty, and it's going to then uh, air out. Now, it's a little bit tight to get my helmet in and out. I will say that. But, I've got my helmet in there and I've got two sets of gloves in there as well. And with that mesh section, you won't have to take it out when you get home. It's going to air out, all that sort of thing. So that's pretty cool. Then, up the top of the bag, right, got another mesh section. And this is for your footwear. Uh, so, shoes are going to go in over there. So that's pretty enough be. And then you might be saying, well, Jason, where do your bats go? Still another compartment down the bottom here. You've got a bat cave, and the cool thing about it is it's actually got a spot for three bats. So I've got my match bat, match bat, which is my Berserker T20 Sax. Got my net bat, which is my Hell 156 club, um, and then I've also got an extra special mongoose in there as well. So three bats in the bat cave. Overall, I certainly give the bag a thumbs up. It's a very good bag. It's going to fit all your gear in. Uh, if you've got keeper gear as well, it's, it's also going to fit in there. <coughs> uh, and if you've got some training gear like a Sky or Bat or a Fusion Multi Stump, that's probably going to fit in there too. So, really good sized bag. Uh, overall quality is fantastic. It is pretty expensive though. I think it's about 160 US dollars. So, but have a look on my website www.cricketstoreonline.com just to confirm. But overall, very satisfactory bag. Very good. Uh, and Kookaburra has done a good job on that. So thanks guys for this awesome bag. Keep up the good work. Cheers. Bye.